J.D. Vance, recently named Donald Trump's running mate for the 2024 presidential election, has quickly become one of the most unpopular vice presidential candidates in U.S. history. Let's explore the reasons behind Vance's unpopularity and analyze how his presence on the ticket might affect Trump's chances in the upcoming election. J.D. Vance's Unpopularity Vance has made numerous controversial statements that have alienated key voter groups. His comments, such as referring to childless women as childless cat ladies and suggesting that childless Americans should pay higher taxes, have sparked widespread backlash. These statements not only offend large segments of the electorate, but also highlight his lack of political tact. Vance's relative inexperience in politics has made him prone to gaffes and missteps. Unlike seasoned politicians, Vance's public statements often appear unvetted and off the cuff, leading to embarrassing moments that diminish his credibility. His apology to Katz, rather than addressing the core issue of his offensive comments about women, exemplifies his political naivety. Vance has been subjected to relentless negative media coverage, amplifying his unpopularity. Stories about his controversial remarks, inconsistent positions, and awkward public appearances have dominated the news cycle. This media narrative reinforces his negative image and makes it difficult for him to recover favorability. Vance's perceived opportunism, particularly his fluctuating support for Trump, has led to questions about his integrity. Voters and political insiders view him as someone who changes his stance based on convenience rather than principle, further eroding trust in his candidacy. Vance's libertarian, techno-utopian ideas and online presence have alienated traditional conservative voters. His ideas often seem disconnected from the concerns of average Americans, making it hard for him to connect with the electorate on a personal level. Impact on Trump's chances. Vance's controversial nature and offensive remarks could alienate moderate and independent voters who are crucial for winning the election. These voters often seek stability, experience, and a unifying presence, qualities they may find lacking in Vance. Vance's unpopularity could energize Democratic and anti-Trump voters, leading to increased voter turnout against the Trump-Vance ticket. The fear of having Vance a heartbeat away from the presidency could mobilize the opposition to vote in larger numbers. While Trump's base is known for its loyalty, Vance's presence might dampen enthusiasm among some segments of Republican voters. Those who are uncomfortable with his controversial statements or view him as an opportunist may be less motivated to vote. The unpopularity of a running mate often shifts the campaign focus from key policy issues to defending the vice presidential candidate. Trump may find himself spending valuable campaign time addressing controversies surrounding Vance rather than promoting his own platform. In critical swing states where the margins are slim, Vance's unpopularity could be particularly damaging. These states require appealing to a broad spectrum of voters, and Vance's divisive image may turn off potential supporters, tipping the balance in favor of the Democratic candidate. What's the conclusion? J.D. Vance's unpopularity as the Republican vice presidential nominee poses significant challenges for Donald Trump's campaign. His controversial statements, political inexperience, inconsistent messaging, and negative media coverage have made him a liability rather than an asset. This unpopularity risks alienating moderate and independent voters, energizing the opposition, diminishing enthusiasm among the Republican base, and diverting campaign focus from crucial issues. In the tightly contested 2024 election, where every vote counts, Vance's unpopularity could be a critical factor influencing the outcome. Trump's campaign will need to navigate these challenges carefully, addressing concerns about Vance while reinforcing their overall message and appeal to the broader electorate.